Throw up the block up to my feet, hurt the slayer, yeah, yeah. Better yeah. off the worst, I took the good with the bad, yeah. yeah. I ain't took a ride in there, they don't come in there, yeah. yeah. I ain't yeah. took a roll down, where they kill me. Yeah. And welcome back to another episode of Lit Podcast. You know how I do it. Y'all already know my intro, so I ain't going to repeat it again. You know what I'm saying? Now, welcome to Lit Podcast, where I bring you the hottest <laughs> artists, the legendary artists, the icons, the up and coming, and everything in between. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know what it is. Y'all hit that like and subscribe. I mean, subscribe. My, my bag. You know what I'm saying? It's that good old green. You know what I'm saying? You know how I do it. Pre-gaming. You know what I'm saying? Pre-gaming. You know what I'm saying? So you know how we do it. You know what I'm saying? But today, you know, man, I got... A special guest. It's been a long time coming. I got him here. You know what I'm saying? For the ones y'all don't know, you know, Mr. Sign Me or Sue Me. Sue you Me or Sign Me, nigga. Mr. Motherfucking Coasting. You know what I'm saying? Mr. Freak Ho and Flows. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Shout out to my nigga Jake Steve, wherever you at, baby. Mr. Free Hoes and Flows, you know what I'm saying? And the motherfucking building, if you don't know, it's motherfucking Kool-Aid in this bitch. What's going down, man? Man, thank you for having me. I appreciate it. I gotta have you, you know what I'm saying? It ain't right, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You can't can't say D-Town without legends or people or pioneers and people that put in the work, you know what I'm saying? Even if the ones that don't know, but if you don't know, like I say, motherfucker, Finna get the note, you know Already. what I'm saying? Like for Shizo. So let's start off like this. I want you to tell everybody again what's your name and where you're from. Mr. Kool Aid, Oak Cliff, Texas. You know what I'm saying? By way of Crooked Eye too. You know what I'm talking about? Shout out to all my people from Irving too. You did. Well, crooked Eye. Tulsa, Oklahoma born. You yeah. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Tulsa, Oklahoma born. You know what I'm saying? Oak Cliff raised and Crooked Eye. You know what I'm saying? I don't know shit. <laughs> 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 so, nah, I used to fuck around in the Crooked Eye shit. My, uh, shit. my mom looked at me crazy when she moved to Irving. I was like, mom, why you moved me here? Nah, I really was mad when she moved me to North Dallas. I said, like, why, why, why you moving to North Dallas? I ain't want to go to North saying. Dallas. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I was a Cliff baby to the heart. Like, you couldn't take the Cliff out. It was just something about when my mama had me, you know what I'm saying, on that porch, you know what I'm saying, on Marseilles, and took me to the parking hospital, and I came back, it was just like something about the cliff, it was just like, I was bred in it, you know what I'm right saying? Right there, right there. Right there, so what part of the cliff are you from? Man, Westmoreland, man, Redbird, you already know. Okay. Kimball okay. High School graduate, High class School. of 2000. Oh. Shit. Oh Old nigga, yeah. Boy, had special year, special well, year. Man, that, that, yeah. What was the coach name? He was famous. Uh, he did everybody. Uh, 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 coach Jones. Is it called the light skinned one? No, nah, basketball. Oh, that's a coach Snoop. Snoop. Yeah, there shout you out go. Snoop. Shout out Snoop. Yeah, shout out Gorilla's dad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. you was, yeah, you was out there with the gorillas. Oh um, yeah, man. And so you were playing ball? Nah, no ball. Nah, I, well, I tried. We we'll tried. <laughs> <laughs> I, I sprained my ankle in ninth grade uh, practice and I was done. What? Oh yeah, man, I was done. Godly <laughs> man, How, well, okay. So M- music has been my thing ever since. I then we were finna talk about music. You know what I'm saying? Like, when did you start? Because I know you were young. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. But and they said, what you about? What say twelve? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I actually started when I was like twelve. Uh, just you know, writing over other people's beats and stuff, and uh, I had ran across a dude in Irving uh-huh. that had a four track in his apartment. I was like eleven or twelve, and I recorded my first jam. I can't remember it, but yeah. well, my uh, my name was Trash. Dude. Yeah, what was his name? Mo Dirt. I don't remember his name. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> my my rap name at that time, at starting off, was MC Danger. That shit was Trash. The MC Danger? No, not shit. MC Danger. Oh, Danger. Yeah, that oh, shit yeah. was. Oh, nah, I don't know. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. MC Danger. You know what I'm saying? I don't know, man. Sure. I got, but I mean, it, we could have worked at that time. Uh, yeah. At that time. Uh, yeah, yeah, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Miss had Danger and all uh, that stuff. Uh, nah, that was way before that. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That was, uh, shit. Probably about shit. Um, uh, I was 12. Shit. So that's probably like 92. Okay. Okay. All 92. Right. I just, I was the nigga that spent all my allowance money at the mall buying CDs and tapes. And, you yeah. know what I'm saying? That's yeah. always been my thing. I, you know what I'm saying? Anybody that really know me know that I've always been an avid music lover and a music collector. Right. Was your mama accept that you listen to the music you were listening to? Oh, she was turning me on to a lot of stuff, too. Oh, okay. Because, yeah. well, uh, you know, back then, uh-huh. when we was growing up, they uh, had the thing in the parade <laughs> where you get... Uh, uh, 
uh, uh, uh, 70 CDs for a penny. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Shit, cheap shit. You know what I'm saying? The cheap shit. You know what I'm saying? But you get good shit. Though, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, like, what was the music that was influenced you? Who you was on? Man, uh, my I, my mama grew up playing a lot of Anita Baker. Okay. Uh, Parliament Funkadelic. Yeah. Prince. Yeah. Uh, Michael, for sure. Oh, yeah. You know Michael. Uh, you ain't had Mike in the house. There's something wrong. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, Marvin Gaye, all that. You right. know what I'm saying? Uh, man. Man, but my mom loved it that Anita Baker, boy. Anita Baker, what? yeah. I heard the Rapture album so many times. <laughs> so, like, wh- so what? What was where the rap come in? Shit, uh, from my uncles and stuff. Uh, you know okay. what I'm saying? Just being around them, right. listening to them, uh, play music. You know right. what I'm saying? Um, yeah, just man. Then you know, being in school, right. influenced and what other people listen to, right? You know? uh, but yeah, hearing my uncles and them play that music and shit. So back then, the music you were listening to, who was the one that really was like, "Hey right, man, this dude, this my rap guy. This is this is this who I like." Man, there was several of them because you know uh, back then, like uh, when yeah. I was first hearing, I, I think the first album that uh, like really amazed me uh-huh. was Ice Cube, America's Most Wanted. Okay, okay. like just the way it yeah. was. Well, because I was already a Public Enemy right. fan, you know what I'm saying. So it. It sounded like a Public Enemy album, yeah, but it yeah. was cute. Yeah, then he had the KKK on there. What? Yeah, he had KKK on there. You know what I'm saying? That album cover it was America, KKK. <laughs> and a whole, and a, whole <laughs> a whole bunch of people behind yeah, it. Yeah, I mean, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, that I mean, Ice Cube was a bad boy, though. You know what I'm saying? All, I think all his albums were underrated. You know what I'm saying? Just think about it, War and Peace. And oh, I had that man. dance underwater and not get wet. Say, what? So, uh, my shit on there was that... Uh, but all the, my ex bitches and all that shit. I love, I love, boy, that war and peace, all that shit go hard. Mm-hmm. We was jamming that. Yeah. But it was messed up, though, you know, how, you know, the generation really changed real fast. Cause, like, next thing you know, she was cute. Like, we be clubbing. <laughs> <laughs> but hey, hey, but hey. But he was still eating them, though. Hey, hey say, my nigga. Say Especially my nigga on Grand to, Finale. I was saying, he had to, well, my nigga had to promote the movies. Yeah, man. he had to promote the movies. Yeah, he, but he was doing it. Nah, well, he was doing oh, yeah. It. <laughs> yeah, nah, for sure. Nah, for real. So, Q was an influence, right? It's okay. Yeah, uh, Face, Ghetto Boys. Oh, yeah, that was um, Face. Man, UGK for sure. Yeah. A ball and MJG. A ball, M. You know what I'm saying? J. Yeah. Motherfucking yeah. G. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> what you know about what? Nigga, what you, what, what you know about some ball? <laughs> well, what you know about some other football? Uh, man, 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 say, man, I get a. Uh, I get a lot of comparisons to eight ball. Right, a yeah, lot of you, people you got they, the tone. You know when what they saying? hear my shit, they say, "Man, this nigga sound like eight ball." Mm-hmm. It's either eight ball or slim. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Eight ball. That's my. That's my guy. I heard Mr. Mike comparisons too. That's my guy, Mr. Mike. That was a bad boy. Hell yeah, yeah. Mr. Mike what? was a bad boy too. You know what I'm saying? Man, that whole suave yeah, roster, yeah. all of it. Man, they had crime boss, crime boss, I love crime boss, and all that shit. Crime boss, crazy. Mm-hmm. You know, shout out Crime Boss. You know what I'm saying? Crime Boss was crazy. He was in his own lane. You know Boy. what I'm saying? So <laughs> now, w- w- when did you start taking the music series? Um, probably around 15 years old or something. I ended up getting with another dude in the apartments. Uh, his name was Sid. He had a record label called C Note uh, Entertainment. Okay. And uh, we'll start doing stuff with him. And uh. Then I actually bumped into my partner, Mr. Mayberry, really, because Mr. Mayberry, my dad, and Mr. Mayberry's mom, they was mm. all cool. They Langston University alumni. All okay, that. So, okay. you know, um, my dad introduced me to Mr. Mayberry, and that's how I ended up getting over there with, he, uh, with eternal life. And We're going to get to eternal life. I'm glad you said eternal life. But before we get to eternal life, like, was at this time when you was oh, Barry and all them, you know what I'm saying, was you – Producing too, or you was just a rapper at this time. I was just a rapper, and you still had Mr. Danger. No, no, I was Kool Aid. Ba- I was Kool Aid by then. Okay, okay, so you was Kool Aid by then. Oh yeah, so, for sure. So where the name Kool Aid, like Kool Aid, and why? Okay, the reason why is uh, I used to go to the bus stop drinking a cup of Kool Aid every morning, and I wouldn't talk to these people that I just met, and they'd be like, "Oh, nigga, you ain't gonna say nothing to nobody. We just go call you Kool Aid." Oh, what? 
You know how that shit go. All right, bet, bet. Damn, the nigga should have. I should change my name to motherfucking Garcia Vega. <laughs> <laughs> and now, uh, uh, it was like, yeah. you coming out here say, not saying nothing to nobody every morning, but you got right. a cup of Kool Aid. Right. Don't tell me that's what's in that cup, okay? Oh, no. I always say, hey, say it. So. <laughs> you ain't had no, you ain't had no, you ain't had no uh, problem with Kool Aid reaching out to you. I know you added the D, extra D to the motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Not yet, not yet. Oh, okay. On some of them it be the extra D, and some of them it don't. You know oh, what I'm uh, saying? And that be confusing. That's who. Uh, that is some people that don't uh, like on the credits. They don't put the extra D. Sometimes, but man, y'all niggas out there, you need to get y'all credit right. Call. That's what split sheets flow. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Do a split sheet. You have all my info, and then you got my number on the split sheet. Call me if you can't get my name right. You know what I'm saying? Get my name right, because that's what they did on the Trap Star album. They, they, mm. they, yeah. They, my name all wrong on there. But they, everybody know who the name that's yeah, on there. Yeah. But it still is like, it's spelled wrong. You know what I'm saying? But it's cool. It's shout like, out, yeah. shout out, Trap Star. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, play us fuck up. Yeah, play us fuck up. You know what I'm saying? But it's already shot. I want my plaque. Uh, but anyway, uh, <laughs> we need to go get that. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? That, we need to go get that from Universal Republic. Man. We need to go get that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. For real. But um, so when did you start? So, okay, when you was do, uh, with Barry, well, did you even produce an album? Was y'all doing mixtape? Oh, what was going was, on at uh, the time? Oh, uh, you talking about with uh, C-No Records? Yeah, C-No Records, yeah. Uh, no, I did a couple of songs with right. him and stuff. I didn't produce an album. I did like a couple of solo joints or right. as a kid, but... No, um, no, I didn't. So let's take the journey to you producing and then hooking up with Eternal Life to do a actual body of project. Oh uh, I mean, shit! I mean, project. Uh, I got with Mr. Mayberry, and okay. he was over there. He just introduced me to everybody that was Eternal at Eternal Life Worm and right. Gator and Sunny Deuce. Uh, right, my boy Monopoly. Uh, yeah, Uncle Ray. See everybody, you know the whole team. Right. Uh, they uh man the man as a kid at that age of sixteen years seventeen years old man that was a uh, environment where I learned a lot of stuff right Sonny Deuce taught me a lot of stuff Joe taught me a lot of stuff yeah that's one uh, Sonny Deuce is the one who was teaching producer, you on the yeah, Triton yeah 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 yeah, uh-huh. yeah. Um, man we it was just an environment for all of us to uh, learn from each other and right it was sharpen our skills and uh. Shit, even at the same time at uh, Eternal Life Studio, uh, Stampede had their studio up there too in the other room for a little while too. Right. To where it was, you know what I'm saying? So it was just always good creative energy. Right. Where was the studio at? Man, in DeSoto. In DeSoto. Shout out DeSoto. Man. Yeah. But a nigga had a lot of nights trying to come down Hampton, boy. <laughs> them laws hot, boy. Or oh, them laws firecrackers, ain't it? You Dem- know what I'm saying? They said, had to stay up at the studio until the morning. <laughs> Dude, that bitch went there with some sun out. Hey, motherfucker be looking at me crazy. Like, I'm like, I'm traumatized. You know, they like, hey, man, them laws ain't bad like that no more. I'm like, man, it's like, look here. My, when I used to roll through there, you know what I'm talking about? Well, you going to be out of socks and drawers, boy. You uh, know what I'm saying? And now, look, we, yeah. in the, we in the eternal life van and shit. Uh, okay. On, on, on fucking uh, uh, tw- uh, 20-inch Dayton's and shit. <laughs> Big necklace on the side of that bitch. <laughs> Whoop. <laughs> now that shout out uh, the Soto PD I mean, dope, it's out whatever. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, mean, I ain't got no warrants out there. You know what I'm saying? I'm good. I'm good. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? For yeah. real. Yeah. So, so Sonny was teaching you how to produce beats on the, what the Triton, right? Uh, no, the Trinity at first. The Trinity Triton. No, it, it was the Trinity at first. Right, it's Trinity, right? It, but it's the core. Right, it's the core. And then then uh using MPC 2000 XL. Oh yeah, that's yeah. and then um. Shit, after that, the Triton came out. Nigga right. learned that. The yeah. Motif came out. Nigga yeah, learned that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Hardware. Right. The, my partner, Rock One, was teaching me how to uh, many different uh, drum machines, like the Roland 5080 and mm. all the Motif sounds and the Triton sounds, and to be able to all slave everything through the MPC. Uh, at that time, I think we had a, a three thousand. Right, you know right, yeah, three thousand MPC. Yeah, yeah, yeah that, that, that's that. Uh, the blue four thousand two. Now, yeah. what's that purple? Ain't the purple one is the four thousand, right? It was purple. Uh, 
I th- yeah, that the, was there. That was the blue one. With the blue and yellow on it was the three thousand. Yeah, and then the uh, what the one thousand or something was the red and red and blue. You yeah. know the little mini box. They yeah, had. but I, it probably I don't remember. It probably was a purple one. Shit, hell, goddamn it. Yeah, shit. by the end I think that it was the four thousand. But yeah, you that know, four thousand was a big shit. Yeah, and then uh, shit. Uh, I seen Spliff doing. Beats and Reason. Shout out Spliff Wayne. Yes, shout out Spliff Wayne. And uh, he uh, kind of, you know what I'm saying, taught me how to do stuff with it. Right. Shit, Rock One helped me, uh, you know what I'm saying, just, man. man. How you link up with Spliff? Oh, you can't shit. just be throwing names out there, man. You be throwing names uh, out there. You, uh, don't, you don't throw worm out there. You don't woo woo woo. you like, you got to let these people know. <laughs> <laughs> man, say, it's a, uh, man, this music, uh, has afforded me to bump into a lot of people. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. And, uh, uh, man, I, I met a Spliff th- uh, when we was working on a Legs album, Straight From High Street. That's what I I had met Spliff when I uh, had came home and I was hearing his beats <laughs> and stuff and uh, from the stuff that Leg was working on and uh, we just, you know what I'm saying? Got, cold one. Yeah, got cool hair, yeah. Yeah, boy, cold yeah, one. yeah, yeah. yeah. I, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I respected his work and uh, we just got cool. Right. You know what I'm saying? Him and uh, B.I. Shout out B.I., man. Man, B.I. just called me. Man, shout out B.I. You get your health right. You know what I'm saying? He done yeah. got out the hospital about twice. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But he just sent me uh, his whole album like two, three days ago. That's what's up. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, me and B.I., you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I keep I keep it locked in. Yeah. With him. Yeah. yeah. He a fool on the beach, too. Oh, you know yeah. What I'm saying? yeah. Matter of fact, yeah. he do uh, damn, what song I got him on? I got him doing the backgrounds on your on one of your tracks. Uh, God damn! Over oh, one of the singles, I forgot I got Bi on one. He yeah. was doing the background, but yeah, shout out Bi. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Man. man, so man, yeah, but so you over there with Led, you working with Spliff? You know what I'm saying? I mean, list, I mean, hooking up with Spliff and he teaching you reasons. So what reasons was your your final destination? Yeah, as as, as of now, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying. Uh, I did some uh, work on one of them new uh, NPC w- uh, boards where it got the uh, program with it now. Right, but right. I, I haven't used like machine or mm. I need to, man, at Ableton. Right. Me, look, I be seeing people do stuff on Ableton yeah. that's real fly. Yeah. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, because you know what I'm saying? You need to stick with that NPC because you know Reason Trash. <laughs> Trash. <laughs> reason Trash. <laughs> the man say. Hey, nah, hey, I'm here. Uh, <laughs> Hey man, <laughs> Dog man, Wars again. Man, and say shout out Papilla Head. Give <laughs> yeah, me a uh, yeah. give me a sponsorship deal, baby. Yeah, I love yeah, Re- yeah. I love Reason, yeah. baby. Already, sure. nah, I man, I fuck with I fuck with Reason. I've been I was man, I was on Reason for a long yeah. time. You know what I'm saying? And then you know, sometimes you have to switch. But I mess with yeah. that. I, I but I do it all. I do Ableton. I do you know what I'm saying? Man, NPC. Say, I, I done that. seen niggas do amazing shit with a lot of amazing shit, bro. Right. Mm-hmm. Um, Niggas be doing tracks on Logic. Mm-hmm. Niggas would be doing tracks straight into Pro Tools. Right. Um, man, yeah. hey, well, however you got to do to get your sauce and your formula going mm. and all of that, do that. Do nah, that, do, that. do that. And all dogs are the same. I just be joking. You know what I'm saying? I just like that. Because <laughs> hey, I, I mess with all dogs. You know what I'm yeah. saying? I respect all dogs. You, you know what I'm talking saying? talking shit. You know what I'm saying? It just, if you, but if you just got a little bit better tools, I might just go with you. You know what I'm saying? But no. Nah. Yeah. So let's talk about it. Let's get there. Let's get there. So now you over there, Eternal Life, ball players, you all in the mix. You 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 messing with everybody in the city. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Now you're getting your legs out there, you're putting in the work, people starting to get it. Cause I'm hearing you, you know what I'm saying? I remember I remember songs like this. <laughs> Constituents got the working part, bitch. It was hustling dog, not militant. With this pen, I'm articulate. Niggas gon' hate the love, niggas gon' love the hate. If you're thinking I'm friendly, I just reach you with my bait. I skate down loop 12 on 12. Three wells, caravan, three cars, be pulling fresh from the detail. <laughs> Man, <laughs> shout out Diamond D. Uh, shout out Diamond D. Uh, shout out uh, Finger and Gator, you know? You know what I'm saying? Ice Mr. Finger. Mr. Ice Finger. Yeah, Mr. Up, Ice homie? Motherfucking Finger. You know what I'm saying? Diamond D. You know what I'm saying? Let's talk about it. Yeah, man. Uh, Diamond uh, <coughs> he hit us up and <coughs> said he wanted us all on the song. Right. <coughs> we went over there and did it. <coughs> but 
nigga had been doing diamond for years, so right, right, it's all good. But uh, what is like, you know, what what, what was y'all atmosphere like working in the studio? Because you got a lot of people who you work. You just can't just be like these. Like y'all got to realize y'all set the wave for a lot of people. You got to realize a lot of people whether you realize that your music went this far or that far. Yeah, it went there. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. So you don't know who you done school. You don't know who you done, you know what I'm saying? You don't know who you done raised out here. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, like when you talk about people like Diamond D, you know what I'm saying, Ice Finger and stuff like that, you know, like like what was that atmosphere like working with these people like that? You know what I'm saying? Oh, shit. It was cool. You yeah. Know, uh, <laughs> man, me and, uh, I think me and Finger and Gator just wrote our stuff. Right. In the, uh, in the car listening to it on the way right. there damn near and. We got there and just, you know what I'm saying, laid it, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Don't y'all know y'all, like you Gator, you know, that click right there. Y'all got that, almost that similar flow pattern, you know what I'm saying? Or, or well, I, I can't even say the flow pattern. I got to say more like the, that, that, that sound, that original, you know, that. Yeah, I, I would really look at it like how it's a, a whole language. Right, and the whole culture. Right, like, there you go. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. That's how I would describe it. Right, you know what I'm saying? Right, um, like just the the word play, the the lyricism. The, right, you know what I'm saying? Right, and picking the tracks. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Yeah, because yeah. that goes a long way too. You yeah, know, like people are really on low that picking the track structure, all that. Who who go here? Who go there? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and uh, I used to like too. When y'all used to put song on, we used to put some songs out in the, in the day. We made sure, like, hey, this is me, you know what I'm saying, and this who rap in order and who's on the song. Oh you yeah, know yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So you'll know who on the song. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> yep, yep. Uh, you man, know? Uh, man, shout out to uh, Quinn Fox, A One, right. um, Teely, Boo Man, Boo Man, uh, Tex. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Everybody that was part of the ball player uh, movement and situation, right? Uh, that ripped all the TMB, all, you know what I'm saying? You remember Spider Man? Yeah, hey, he what? was with Diamond, wasn't he? I think he was with Diamond. Yeah, I, I wonder what ever happened to Spider Man. I ain't seen Spider Man years, man. Me either, but he used to be always hustling that album though, man. Shout out Spider Man, man. Shout so, out to you, Spider. Yeah, yeah now nah, for real. So, like, who you grew up listening to in Dallas though? Who who was your influences in Dallas? I would have to say, uh, Doc, for sure. I had to say it was phenomenal to hear that back then. He he's with NWA and he's not cussing, right? But his music did not sound one less inch of harder <laughs> than NWA. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but shit, he was writing the shit for NWA, so. But you know, it was crazy. That's why I was saying he writing the stuff for NWA, and he got the cussing in it. You know what, yeah. what I'm saying? But, that, but when he rap, when he rap his verse, he ain't even he ain't even cussing. It's like what? DLC was cold, yeah. and then even before he went to Dallas, what he had there with uh, what a what was it, Tom Joyner? Man, not, I hate uh, to go to work. Man, I hate to go to work. That I love, song. Man, I love that motherfucker song. <laughs> beep, beep. I love that shit, nigga. <laughs> man, the best say, hey man, everybody say, hey yeah, man, hey. man, I hate to go to work. Man, I miss them days, man. Flavor yep. TV, man, drive by slapping. You know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, one hundred three jams, yeah, one hundred three jams. You know what I'm saying? Like, and but and then too, I remember when K one hundred four really wasn't playing hip hop like that. You had to really be like. Yeah, on a certain channel to really yeah. catch the music like that back then. Man, 103 was playing yeah. it. Yeah, 103, yeah. You know what I'm saying? And what was that? Uh, uh, ooh, they going to... Ooh, it was 103. Yeah, K-O-N-O-N. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, there you go. Shout out Bobo Neal. Yeah, yeah, Bobo, all them. You know what I'm saying? They kept they keep us tight. You know, I had it right there. I'm talking yeah. to you. Yeah, that's what I'm telling you. That's why you got to stay lit. You know what I'm saying? got to stay lit. You know what I'm saying? You be in that glitch. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking that Matrix had you. Say. Oh, for real. You know what I'm saying? So, like, you don't work. You Man, like, who all have you worked with? Shit. I, mean, I mean, I'm talking about little Mario. I know one. You know what I'm saying? You got uh, you. man. I done work with as a man as engineering too. Damn, I done recorded people zero. Me and him got a whole beat together. Right. That I still ain't done nothing with. I'm waiting on you, Ro. If you still want to fuck with it, Ro, come on with it. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm talking about? But uh, shit, Rich the Factor. Uh huh. Um, man. Um. 
Rich the fact just a, big, baby. But, yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I, nah, Rich still pushing. Yeah, I know. You uh, know rich what I'm saying? Pushing. Yeah. Um, damn. A lot everybody around here right. for the most part. You right. know what I'm saying? Right. Who okay, let me ask you this today, since you don't work with everybody around here. Who was the person you enjoy working the most from here? Even though I know you enjoyed everybody, but like, what was that one? Was just like, man, man, this right here, this man, I've been waiting on this. I would probably have to say um, during the days of the when we was working on the ball player projects, mm -hmm. just the camaraderie and right. the, the friendly competition and friendly sparring. You know what I'm saying? Right, right. Niggas getting the, uh, hearing the beat and getting on the song, and everybody going they, to their respective corners and. Nigga, yeah, yeah, you know what yeah. I'm saying? right. Yeah, I'm finna, I'm finna eat. Like I, when I come out of this corner, I'm swinging. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And who was that? You know what I'm saying? Like shit, me, Quint, Gator, and A One for shit show. Okay, A One. Yeah. Now, Quint. See, a lot of people don't talk about Fox and don't give him his flowers. And you know, so I want to give Quint his flowers. Say, like, Quint Flock say, like, man, he been consistently. Always. That nigga got down there 30 or 40 albums. Man. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, y'all need to say when you we see when you when you speak the D, you gotta know the D. You know what I'm saying? That's one thing, you know what I'm saying? So you speak the D, know the D. You know what I'm saying? That's all I'm gonna yeah. say. I'm gonna leave it there. Quinn Fox, you know what it is. You know what I'm yes, saying? Yes, sir. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? A1, yeah. Damn, just, you know niggas, what I'm saying? They already know. I'ma tell you. All about, the, you know, ball players. We're going to talk about them working with the ball players. Also, we're going to talk about, uh, uh, I want to talk about Bowleg real quick. I want to talk about Stampede real Fred quick. Fred Beasy. Fred Beasy, man. Say, what man, up? Fred Beasy, what's up? Say, man, you know who's a motherfucking beast on a motherfucking ball player? Like, I really had to tune into? Who? <laughs> Hellraiser. Oh, say, shout out my nigga Hellraiser, man. Motherfucking Hellraiser <laughs> is raw. Oh, say, uh, man. Hellraiser, uh, man, I was producing some stuff on this album that we didn't ever get to release, but I was producing some stuff on him. I was like producing some stuff on Heartstopper, uh, work at home, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I was producing, man, when I came home from prison in 2002, I was like uh, starting to produce a lot of stuff for them uh, for them back then. Okay. And uh, man, man, me and Hellraiser was... Uh, Winning talent shows around this motherfucker, raking up cash, nigga. Yeah, rake it up, rake it up. On that shaky thong, we was yeah. killing. <laughs> Shout out my nigga Edo. Yeah, two times, man. So, like, ball players, let's get there. You know what I'm saying? We're going to keep it moving. You know what I'm saying? Ball motherfucking me players. Yeah. Like, working with them, because ball players was hot. In 2000s, couldn't say nothing. You know what I'm saying? Ball players was on that we already knew, you know what I'm saying. So, how did that come together, and why the ball players kind of like, you know what I'm saying, disappear uh, in a way? Shit, um, I guess everybody just kind of a lot of stuff happened. Right. You know what I'm saying. I was getting, uh, I was uh going through shit, you know. Leg had end up getting locked up. Right. Um, just a whole bunch of stuff going right. on. You know what I'm saying? Uh, just niggas just had to go do their thing and right. move their separate ways and stuff. You know. Right. But um, I still fuck with man. I fuck with everybody from that shit. Right. Everybody know that. Right. You know what I'm saying? And they know they can reach out and fuck with me. I be fucking with Queen. I fuck with A One. You know what I'm saying? League, everybody. Right. You know, so, um, shit. Nigga just really just a lot. You know, life happens. Niggas right. start having kids and right. families. And, <laughs> oh, yeah. Kids going to you know do it all the time. Um, kids you know, going to do it all the time. Um, well, so what was y'all mind frame at? Like, where was y'all trying to take ball players? Because y'all y'all already had the image, y'all already had the style. We already knew y'all was about money. We already knew y'all was player. We know we we knew y'all when he, when ball players came. We know oh them them boys. You know what I'm saying? So like, where was y'all vision at? Like, where was y'all trying to take this to be some of the? I felt that what I wanted to put in it is just to be respected on some real rap MC shit. Some real, you know what I'm saying? Some real music shit. You know, right? Um, 
talent. Right. Uh, spitting metaphors, spitting bars, picking dope beats. Uh, right. You know what I'm saying? Uh, different flow cadences, all that stuff. Right. I just we I wanted to just always be uh you know what I'm saying respected on the the rapper shit you know right. what I'm saying man yeah. and, and, and like and you got the respect you know what I'm saying because right now this is what this for this is giving your flowers man, you know what I'm saying you. and this and and and, 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 and and also it's shedding light to you know how it was back then you know what I'm saying like what 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 was it like like making these albums or being with these groups and then getting out here trying to sell these records or put, shop these records and, and things like that. Man, uh, we we did some uh, good shows, man. We did some good shows. Uh, had a lot of good times. Uh, stuff was selling, you know what I'm saying, cool. You know right. what I'm saying? But... Um, why, like, what, everybody had to burn their own copies, what, and uh, split them up, go sell them, what, everybody had, what, what how how was the machine work, yeah, what was the process? Shit, I think, uh, nigga was fucking getting them motherfuckers pressed up and, uh, distributed it through, uh, I think Music Access. At that time? I think so. In the, in the early 2000s? Oh, uh, no, what was that, no, what is that, Green Room? What is that, Green Room? No, is that green room? It, it was a green room. <laughs> oh, is it green room or uh, crystal clear? One of them motherfuckers. <laughs> Look, I think crystal clear was where you pressed them up at or something. I don't know, but I don't know where where they was getting their stuff distributed at, at that time. Because I know at that time you could walk in, you know, and you know, in certain stores and get their albums. You know, some of them you could, you know, you had to get it off the street, you know, oh, yeah. or whatever, or whatever the case may yeah, be. Yeah, uh, man, niggas, man, we was floating the motherfuckers through the hood. Mm -hmm. Uh, That's how it go. It was a uh, man. <laughs> a lot of people, uh, man. It, it be people sometimes still, uh, still got them, right? Like still, still physical copies. That they like, I don't even got that no more. You still got it. <laughs> so man, who all who who people you always want to work with in the city that you ain't work with, and who do you want to work with that's. Not from the city and, and have some, you know, some status that you want to work with, that you always want to work with. Man, I'm trying to, as far as this, uh, here in the city, mm -hmm. man, I'm uh, open to work with anybody, man. Right. You know what I'm saying? As, as long as we can make some jamming music and it makes sense. Right. Uh, <laughs> That's, that one, that, that's your line right there. As long <laughs> as it makes sense, goddamn me, <laughs> shit, man. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <coughs> you know. I would work with anybody. I ain't tripping. Oh, so you ain't been having your own. Man, I ain't, work, I ain't work with Twisted. Twisted Black? Yeah, I, I would like to do something with Twisted. You know what I'm saying? Shout uh, out Twisted Black. Shit, Solo Lucci too. He he dope. Yeah, Solo Lucci, bro. Solo Lucci, Ben Rock. You know what uh, I'm saying? I like, like Lil Ronnie, MF. Yeah, Lil Ronnie, MF. Yeah. Um, shit, um. It's a lot. There's so much talent right. out there, it's, man. It's a lot of talent. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of talent that passed away, too. Yeah. It's a lot. You know what I'm saying? We done lost a lot. Man. Yeah, for real, for real. Like, shit, especially C. Strugs, man. Shout out C. Strugs. Yeah, shout out C. Strugs, yeah, for man, sure. Yeah, for real. He was one of those. He was oh, one that, of those. Oh, my nigga was punishing. <laughs> you know, his partner passed away, too, Big Tank. I don't know if you remember Big Tank. He was with them over there. He was over there messing with uh, Clone Free and stuff like that. I don't think I uh, uh, met Tank. Oh yeah, met Tank. Yeah, he he passed away like about a year or so, man. Ago, man. But yeah, man, like let's 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 go like the 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 stars. Like who you always want to work with? Did you? Hmm. Man, I be cut. Man, I be man, cause just as a producer, you and know, and they what? can be old and new. It don't matter. Oh uh, no, no, I, it'd be crazy, cause I as a producer, right. I'm like a man. I, I you do some beats sometimes. You make right. man, such and such a sound good on this yep. song, and yep. that's, you know what I'm saying. That's right. how I be. Cause right. I be going by what the right. The song is telling right. me. Who but needs. that mojo though, that you I know you're a producer, you get that, you like, damn shit, I gotta have I gotta yeah. have ball on it. Yeah. I gotta have yeah, yeah, you know sure. what I'm saying? I like got, for real. Man, yeah. yeah. I got songs like that right. already kind of set to the side where 
certain artists if I ever be able to get them. Um, right. Yeah. Because I know you got the one with Ro, for sure, for sure. Oh, you yeah, know what I'm yeah, saying? You yeah. waiting on him to come, you know what I'm saying? You yeah, man. Gobble on that motherfucker, goddamn you, know? you know he got no, no Diddy, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. No, or no, no diddler. diddler, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> 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 you know what I'm saying? You got to watch these boys on the internet, man. Boy. These boys, they, boy, they, boy, they are clickbait. The comments, <laughs> the comments, man. Lord. <laughs> Comments. So let's let's talk about sign me. You know assume what I'm saying? Assume me. me. What's the yeah so yeah? You know what I'm saying? Assume me or sign me. What's that all about? Man, shit. Uh, at that time, I was just like, it was the mixtape kind right. of game where right. I was like, man, I'm gonna just rap over any beats I want, and you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna get sued behind this shit, or somebody gonna do a deal with me or something. You know, <laughs> that's the Disney shit right there. Like, nigga, I, nigga, what, nigga, nigga, this my shit, nigga. I'm gonna rap over this shit. <laughs> like, what, nigga? Like, nigga, I'm gonna take the Al Green tape, put it up in there, nigga. Put the tissue in the tape, Man. press record, nigga, and yep. shit, and then and got Tupac gun, and nigga, I'm running it, nigga. I'm running <laughs> it. Yeah, the other tape, this, yeah, nigga. Yeah, yeah, the other tape, this mine, man. What you talking about, man? Mm. Shit, come to the studio, man. Download it. Well, you got NAFTA and all that, you know what I'm saying? Bear shut nigga. Download that. Give me, oh, they got instrumentals. I think the studio, <laughs> nigga, load that shit up, nigga. Load that shit up. Load that shit up, nigga. It's going down. Nigga, nigga. finna kill these niggas shit. Nah, for real, man. So, like, what was your top song on that on that project? Oh, with uh that uh the first Sue Me Assignment mm -hmm. or the second one? The first one. Oh shit. That's like asking what is your favorite kid? I, I can tell you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just playing. <laughs> I love all my, I love all my damn I love songs. All my kids too, but yeah. shit, goddamn, you know how one of them always have, you know, know, you know, you got a lot of us got different personalities, and yeah. just and just us, yeah. you know what I'm saying. So when you see it coming out of your kid, you like, damn, you got that of me, you got this of me, you got that of me, yeah. like, like how in the fuck? <laughs> you know what I'm like, I think the. Uh, the, the song that people know off there the most is probably Which Way Is Up, though. Yeah, Which Way Is Up. Yeah. yeah. Uh, the, so the one of the people grab R.I.P. to my nigga AK. I mean, R.I.P. two times. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Nah, for real, for real. Like, so, uh, man, like, golly, man, why everybody be losing people, man? It be crazy. It be crazy, man. It's like, Rich Homie Cron. Like, yeah, R.I.P. Like, to that brother, too. It's like, golly. It's like every time. Da, 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 da. Man, Fat Man Scoop, all that. Man. Like, all the shit happening all. Man, going down. Man, shh. it's a bless. It's a blessing to be above the ground every day. Right, for real. Godly, man. You, man. You, man. That's that's crazy, man. That's crazy, man. What, man. So, let's talk about damn food. Damn food project. Mm hmm. Yeah. I mean, you got plethora, plethora, <coughs> plethora <coughs> of <coughs> great <coughs> tracks, beats, yeah. lyrics, <coughs> and artists. I'm talking about Hot Boy Star, Nino. Nino you know, and, and you got, that's the one you got Lil' Mario on. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. How the hell you get like Mario on there, man? Man, I admit, uh, Mario, uh, one night, nigga was uh, flipping through the city, and I met that nigga at a gas station, fam. Shout out, Mario. Shout out, Lil' Mario, <laughs> man. Keep it real. You know what man? my nigga, so I, I, was like, I was like, say, nigga, I do music, nigga. I'm, hit, I'm uh, down there, I'm finna hit the studio tomorrow. Right. I let him hear some shit, he, uh, him and uh, Wendell, you know what I'm saying, came through, you know what I'm saying? And shit, that nigga, man, Mario a stiff nigga. He a cool nigga, bro. I'm so, fresh, man. you know, we, uh, that's the homie. We right. good. Right, man. Shout, <laughs> man, shout out two times now. That's love. I still got to get down there and fuck with you, brody. Right, man, because, you know, sometimes you, because people don't understand, I was watching um all the dialogue and uh, what's the old boy name from, um, he played in. He was Stacy. I'm gonna call him Stacy. Oh, you talking about DeAndre Bond? Yeah, yeah, DeAndre Bond. He, <laughs> he on the, all the dialogue. Yeah, right I, now. I haven't seen it yet. Man, bro. that boy <laughs> raw, man. He going off. Man, he going off, man. He, I'm talking about he went straight beast mode and he was just talking about, you know, meeting Cube and meeting Tupac and yeah. da da da, or meeting, you know, people who's famous, you know, yeah. or, or have a, a bigger status, you know, and how they treat you, you know what I'm saying? How he treat him, you know what I'm saying? I, I just want to commend Lil Mario because a lot of people can act Hollywood because Mario was, you know, he was that back in the day, you remember? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, back in the day, you know what I'm saying? When he was coming out switching hot. Oh, yeah. yeah. 
outlet, you know what I'm saying? Say, man, that nigga was man, nigga was cool, bro. Yeah, you he know was, what I'm saying? I and, like uh, down there. He, no, he, he uh he told me he fucked with my music and you know what I'm saying? It was, you know. Shit. I know you got some more, you got some hard shit, you know what I'm saying? And then Hot Boy Star. You know what I'm saying? And uh, Nino, Nino, that's a you know shout out Corey Clegg Horn. You know what I'm saying? They invited me Cal- to uh, Oh, Calhoun? Oh, no, Cal- Corey Clegg Horn. Cal- Horn. Yeah, we always yeah. been saying this name wrong. That's why he be looking at it like. No, Corey Clegg Horn. What's up, baby? <laughs> yeah, what's up, man? Yeah, <laughs> yeah shout out to Nino and Star. Yeah, okay. He yeah. looked that up. Yeah. Yeah, we, okay. uh, and we just, you know, I came up to the lab yeah. one day and I just uh, hopped on that track. Right. Mm-hmm. They lost one of eight, man, say. Man, they lost. Man, say too many people losing. You know what I'm saying, man. So what? What about you know, uh, like the new stuff you're working with? What you got working on right now? I think you brought me this right here. Oh man, uh, man, you know what I'm saying? I won't be denied. Is I won't out, be denied. You know what I'm saying you know on what I'm all saying? the uh, all, all the platform, platforms. You, you know, know what I'm saying. Yeah, you know, I mean, out. people bring on me Spotify, Mr. Kool Aid with two D's. You yeah, dig? Yeah, yeah, all yeah. that. Yeah, on all the platforms. I already, man. I appreciate that too. You know what I'm saying? Like I say, people bring me goodies too. You know what I'm saying? I be jamming. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. So like, the what makes you one thing keep going, and who always been your big support as far as you and this music? Man, I keep going because I man, this shit is in me. Uh, man, I live this music shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? So. Sometimes I don't feel right if I'm not doing music. Right. <laughs> you know nah, what I'm for saying? real, for real. <laughs> I was talking about that today. I was like, man, I didn't want to quit working. Just <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you to know be able what to do you music all day of day. Because that's what I'm used to. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like I'm, I'm used to being yeah. locked up, you know what I'm saying, yeah. and learning this. Because I remember when I really started putting my shit together, you know what I'm saying? I remember being in my mom's bedroom, you know what I'm saying? I mean, my mama house and my mama from bedroom and then just, you know, big, gone, you know what I'm saying, all that, you know what I'm saying, couch in that mug, you know what I'm saying, I'm setting up, you know what I'm saying, yeah. like, because, I mean, it was it because I was always going to other people's studios rapping, woo woo, and I was just like, you know, I'm learning, learning, just like you say, yeah. you know, and then you peep game and then yeah. shit, hey, and, you, just, uh, and take it to a whole, all yeah, shit. play all that shit and take it to a whole nother level, yeah, you know what I'm saying, that's what it's about, and that's what this podcast is about, too, is like teaching you know what I'm saying? Teaching people, you know what I'm saying? Because, like, when you brought up the uh, music access, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, my my whole my whole thing was, you know, I wasn't trying to down nobody or belittle nobody. You know what I'm saying? My whole objective was to make sure that my people understand the business, the music the, business. That, that nigga was right. on alert. Right. You know what I'm saying? Just let you know. Like, say, man, you, you slipping. You know what I'm saying? I'm finna help you, you know, get up. You know what I'm saying? You, nigga, you know, like, get your stuff together because... One thing about us, especially in Dallas, like we always we always talk about this. It's the same story. It's the same writing on the wall. Everybody's stealing for Dallas. Everybody, you know what I'm saying, uh, 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 get to, to a certain uh, point with the money, the hottest artists for that time, and then everybody go right back. They right back in the hood. and <coughs> Or they never <coughs> reap the benefits from their success and stuff like that. So my, my whole objective is like, say, you know, hey, like, you can do it like this, and if we can all come together, or we ain't all got to come together, because I know sometimes it, it just don't happen, you know what I'm saying? Everybody's on different time zones, you know what I'm saying? And yeah. I get it, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But the majority of you who can, like, shout out Pookie Leroy for making shit like that. Yeah, happen, yeah, you know shout saying? out to all y'all boys My, oh, that's yeah. doing all them uh, ciphers, man. Yeah. That's, a, uh, that's a good thing. Y'all keep on doing them. Yeah, keep on doing them, you know what I'm saying? But it's like putting that together. And learn this business. Really take if you really trying to make money off of whatever you trying to do. If you doing these beats and you trying to lease, because the producer, like I say, you the holy grail. You the one who control this. You can't let yeah. these people be running out of studios until paperwork is done. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know, whatever it is. You know what I'm saying? Like shit, engineers too. You know what I'm saying? Hey man, make sure. You know, it, I mean, if you got customers, but you like put a bug in that ear. You know what I'm saying? Especially around here, I feel like people are like, why you get a game away free? Man, you can do my boy T. You know what I'm saying? Man, you can charge them two thousand this and and run up the game. Well, I say I give it away for free is because. And I'm sorry, I'm taking no podcast, but I gotta get this no. off my chest. <laughs> no, I, gotta, I gotta get this off my chest because. <laughs> I give it away for free because Dallas, we've been we've been behind too long, and there's a whole plethora of talented people that uh, got overlooked. Uh, 
You know what I'm saying? There's a whole bunch of people from the city, man. Right. From the whole DFW that's talented right. as hell. Right. And there's a lot of niggas who from the city who I already uh, had sing, money. Uh, so singers it really and everything. nothing to them. You know what I'm saying? A lot of, it's a lot of the boys who already had money, so it really wasn't nothing to them. You know what I'm saying? To a person who actually really write rhymes and really do this and really hungry for them rhymes, you know what I'm saying? They ain't got the money and really hungry for just really putting his lyrics out there and feeding itself, you know what I'm saying, at the same time. So it's like, you know, and I get it, you know what I'm saying? But my thing is, like, we can do that, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, like, Dallas, people, like, when you go to Los Angeles, City of Angels. Yeah. New York, the Big Apple. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? What's it? Uh, Cleveland, Brother Love. When you go to Dallas, that's City of Hate. Oh, damn. <laughs> oh yeah! Oh, see, and, see, and that's the thing. People don't even know that's our title. I didn't know that. We've been having that. We've been having that for since for the forever. For, uh, Dallas is the city of hate. Just think about that. Let that sink in. Damn. And there's haters everywhere. Yeah, it is. But to be la labeled that far as the art, you know, like uh, mantra, right? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Uh, damn, it says I, uh, a lot. <laughs> that says a lot. <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's you know what I'm saying. That's crazy. It says a lot. <laughs> yeah, you know? yeah, it does. Uh, man. Uh, even I, if it's not necessarily our <coughs> truth, it's from that's from others' perspective and how they view it, so they let you know we gotta move differently because that's how everybody else sees it, and that's why stuff happens the way it does. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Man, say, but I'm I'm gonna stop preaching to the choir. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm gonna get back. I'm gonna get back to it hey. because. But some things have to be said. You know what I'm yeah. saying? And like, like I say, like my podcast. I don't I like people. Oh, you a blogger? No, I'm not a blogger. You know what I'm saying? Like I did this. I literally started this. I started this because I wanted to teach people how to do their paperwork. And, yeah. and I also wanted to give the people the platform that they need to keep pushing. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, because like Flavor TV, at one point in time, they was damn, they man, you know, shout out Flavor TV. I ain't taking nothing from nobody. I'm just saying, at that time, they that platform was damn near here. You, yeah, you got to see who our artist was in Dallas. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Man. You had certain radio stages, Fish Bowls, and all that stuff like that. Yeah, Fish that, Bowl was, that was that was. Here, you, you had the quarries with the clubs that was yeah. booking us and moving us yeah. here and there. Here, yeah. you know what I'm saying? You had the rainwaters, you had this, you know, you had all that. You know what I'm saying? But it's like we never ever honed it in and we never ever really taught ourselves what it, how to go get these plaques, how to go work with these people, how to just like, well, how he get the, how, how he get the, uh, over there to, uh, uh, United Masters or how he get over there with them, with that company. Well, he, uh, well, yeah, the manager just drove on the road, went over there and met these people. Yeah. Got their number contact, yeah, booked the uh, meeting. Yeah, man. Get up. Uh, you say everything ain't on the internet. But everything ain't on the internet. <laughs> Everything ain't <laughs> on Just my partner Say my partner My partner got the money Let me just sit right here Until he make these moves And moves and stuff like that And then you know He getting out here Making the moves And you just sitting there Instead of actually Getting up and getting out there And seeing what's really going on Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying But you know Hey we back to it So cool like yeah. <laughs> Cool like What's up Cool like What's up man? <laughs> <laughs> man. Man, chilly, man. You got, you, oh, uh, man, you, man. Uh, you got that good, and we good. Man, yeah, we, I'm gonna keep the yeah. good. You know what I'm saying? Matter of fact, I got some good right here. Rougher than drug vegan, baby. Mama see me, she tell me she wanna fuck me. I'm ripping down the sixes to kill you, then do the duck and get live when we club, baby. Thug, yeah, trust me. Pulling up in something custom, sitting on buttons, shitting on these boys. Please give me your pack of hookies. Holla at my guala, he told me he finna plug me. With different types of good. It's to satisfy all the drug Man, you know what? I don't like comparing people. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> but I do. I do this. Yeah. And I know how to put people together. Yeah, yeah. And you and Bo Fly? Oh, that's my nigga Blow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm on uh, I'm on one of his mixtapes. And uh, <laughs> he on one of my, you know what I'm saying, albums. We going to do some more music. I was a... Uh, yeah. I had uh, spoke to him the other day. Man, you, know yeah. you and Blowfly. Yeah, shout out to Definitely. Blowfly. Y'all go check out our Blowfly shit. Too, oh, yeah. Man. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? That right there, especially y'all bring one out with a video. You know what I'm saying? Like that's the thing, man. We need some. We need. We need some visuals, man. <laughs> yes, sir. We, we need some visuals, <laughs> man. You know what I'm saying? Hey, like, go get on top of that. Go yeah, get man. Because you know, people don't don't get. It. I tell people like this. You know what I'm saying? 
it's always the lane for us and people still want to see. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. No matter what. You know yep. what I'm saying? No matter what you're doing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Do it. You yep. know what I'm saying? And whatever you do in life, do it to the motherfucking fullest. <laughs> to the fullest, nigga. Do it to the motherfucking fullest. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, bro. Say, I just, um, yeah, just ready to come out with this uh, new music. Um, right. I'm finna drop some stuff, you know, videos and stuff. Okay, all uh, right. Me and my partner Tio working on a project, you know what I'm saying? We got that dog in me coming, you yeah. know. Yeah. Uh, that's gonna be the first single off of it, but we got singles in the in the tuck, you know. Okay, so this project right here, just both of y'all back and forth. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, no yeah. other features, just y'all. Just not, straight. not yet. Oh, it's okay. just me and him. Okay. All yeah, right. and uh, all right. my nigga Chad B got mm -hmm. something with him. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I've been doing uh, uh, stuff on uh, my partner Link album. It's uh, he finna drop an album uh, September 14th. Keep going. Yeah, make sure y'all go cop that. Go get that. Go you get that. Saying? Now, you you work with Chase Pat. My nigga Chase Pat. Chase Pat. Greedy Grow. Greedy he, Grow. Greedy Grow, boy. Grow. Shout out to all them Grow boys. You know what I'm saying? Shout out my boy Bunky and all them. Grow you know what I'm saying? You know, the NFL boys and all that. You know Run, what I'm saying? Feezy baby. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> damn D. Yeah, damn D. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Just love me. Yeah, my niggas. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Shout out two times. Say, man. So what have like seen? Have you seen the have you seen the move his move and went in number with Mo three? Uh what was it called it? Uh uh the uh Triple V Revenge. Revenge. Yeah. Yeah, I seen that. What you think of what you think about his role uh, up in well, there, uh, uh, who which role? Uh, it was Chase Pat. He was oh, yeah, that. so yeah, my nigga. Oh yeah. yeah man, what you talking about? Oh yeah, like, I'm tripping, bro. Yeah, you tripping, boy. I'm high in the bitch. <laughs> I told bad. you we lit, bitch. We lit, bitch. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on man. Hold on. But nah, it's not good. It's not hey, good, baby. Hey, hey, you know what I'm saying? God damn, that nigga's like, God. My that nigga, knees. Man, that nigga said, man, I'm sorry. I'm high, that motherfucker. All right. Make no. sure I got my shit. No, I know. My nigga Chase Pat did his thing in that movie, bro. Man, yeah, he did his motherfucking thing. You know what I'm saying? I, I really do. Think you know what I'm saying? That was a good look. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah. You know for the whole city, man. You know, it was shot well. It's uh yeah. Um, it's a man. It's a uh. A shout out to all the filmmakers right. and actors and stuff from the D that's doing oh, their yeah. thing, they, man. They, they, you thinking about what you think about you doing movies? You think about doing movies? What's the next chapter in your life? You know what I'm saying? Man, because you got a book. You know what I'm saying? You really got a real story to tell, and then you know what I'm saying. One day, you know what I'm saying? What you how you how you gonna put this out there? Man, I'll probably be a uh, on some directorial right. if anything. Okay, you know what I'm Ain't saying. Really, just uh, putting the stories and the vision together yeah. and find the right actors to do that stuff. Right, I, right. I don't think I can act well. Man, if shit, man, the shit I've seen on Tubi. <laughs> Nigga, shout out to me, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, yeah. Shout out to me. Yeah, but that, that's the shit. All that shit I seen on Tubi, nigga, <laughs> nigga, everybody, nigga, everybody can do a movie. Goddamn, let me tell you. What, the, what, the, what does it understand everybody. me? Goddamn me. You yeah. know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Hell you mean. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> nah, for real. Yeah, now nah, the cool. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hey, ain't nobody over there smoking? What? Nigga, well. <laughs> What, okay. what, 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 for me, nigga. It's both for me, because you don't got there, y'all ain't smoking? Man. Uh, okay, uh, shit. Yeah. Damn it. Yeah, oh, yeah, 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 it's going down. So, like, so, movies, they got a new project coming, you know what I'm saying? And what about production? You been producing for anybody lately? You know what I'm saying? Or is it just strictly just for this album? Man, I just been, uh... I haven't been producing for a lot of people lately. I've just been mostly focused on in-house stuff. Just uh, I'm going to come out with an album uh, called I Did It All, mm -hmm. and I'm going to do every beat on it. Okay. All right. Every and beat on it. What's the name of the label? You got your own Man, label. High Class now? Music Group, baby. Yeah, okay. You already know. I already. Mm -hmm. Yeah, represent that. You yes, know what sir. I'm yes, yeah, sir. You got to represent that. Yeah. Man. Hey. So, yeah. So what you, what you think the future of the D? It's looking like, you know what I'm saying? So I like, uh, you know what I'm saying, what the youngsters is doing, man. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Montana and them, and they doing their thing, bro. Mm -hmm. I, uh, I love to see everybody around there. If you able to, you know what I'm saying, make money off this music industry at a time like this, do it and milk it. Facts, facts, facts. So if I, if I ask you a question, like, if there was anything in Dallas that was broken need to be fixed, what would it be? 
Hmm. Probably uh, people finding better ways of communicating with each other. Right. <laughs> what, so, so what is like coming up like? Because so, a lot of people out there, because I got, I have a when I look at my analytics, I see the type of people who watch and where they from and stuff like that, and it, it'd be intriguing to me. So, like, I be wanting them to know, like, what is it? What is it like coming up in Dallas? You know what I'm saying? Like, man, it's a uh, man. I I done built a lot of uh, relationships through the years in right. this, in this music scene in Dallas. You uh-huh. know what I'm saying? I, it's a lot of people I love. You know, it's all good, but. We don't we don't uh we don't have to be tripping with each other. Right, right. Facts, facts. Yeah, I, I just I wish y'all youngsters are quick tripping with each other with all that drill stuff to a certain extent, bro. Man, that drill. Y'all man. boys, y'all boys got to kind of chill. I ain't trying to sound like the preacher man and nothing. But. Right, but yeah, they taking it a little too far because they just they just sliding in and everywhere, you know, like shh. And then, as I don't know. I mean, I know we was messed up. Don't get me wrong. We was messed up when we were growing up. Yeah, we was doing. We was doing the most. They, I know. I I know the niggas I was around. I know me. I know I was doing the most, bro. But they gonna t- they man. man they gonna, I mean, they my, gonna, man. They gonna take the music industry. If if niggas keep on tripping, mm-hmm. they gonna take the music industry away, nigga. They already trying to do it. Now I'm glad you brought that up because that's what I that's what I was gonna talk about because they talking about taking the music industry away from us. But Shit. you know what? You can't take the music industry away from us. You know why? Yeah. Because the music industry is us. Oh yeah, it's, it's totally. Whatever us. we do, how we do it, they gonna follow it. You know what I'm saying? Because it, just because, because like right now they was having a lawsuit on, on Live Nation because Live Nation make this monopoly because now you can't do nothing. They these people record labels nothing. They can't do nothing unless they go through Live Nation and Ticketmaster because they done bought up everything. Yeah, you got the All you the got the venues and the, and the tickets. Yeah, the rights. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? They got the concessions. You know what I'm saying? Shit. Like <laughs> and like and it's like my thing I noticed about us, our people. It's like. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, you outside. But like my boy say, my people act like they scared to come outside. <laughs> no, I, you know, yeah. I'm, I'm being serious. Because when we was, when we was coming up, we was outside. You had to be 30, there. 40 you had to be deep. there. 30, 40 deep. You had to be there. You know what I'm saying? We were out there. Yeah. You had to be live in the flesh. And we was making way. We were making do. Yeah, we were getting trouble. This, 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 that. Sometimes we were just getting trouble just chilling. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, just, my nigga just got caught. You know, he just got caught up. You know what I'm saying? Boy. But shoot, nigga, you know, but my thing is, we was out there. I mean, we all had a vision. We all had time where we sat out. We in the studio. You know what I'm saying? When Man. we could have been over here. Oh, but we mad nigga, at this hey, nigga. No, hey, okay. nigga done passed that 10,000 <laughs> hour shit. Right. There you go. You know what I'm saying? There you go. You know what I'm saying? Nigga like, way past that. Like, I, I learned, I got partners who sit there, you know, learn how to fucking fix a car. Put a whole thing, of car from scratch. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, think about how many partners we had back then that had so much talent. The same way these little kids right now got. And, yeah. But they ain't even tapped into it. The first thing, they first talent was a, a switch. Uh, because you got to realize their whole generation was the Grand Theft Auto. Boy, but man, I man say, <laughs> man, you want to get old, man. You want to live long. You want to live a life free out of jail. You want to, you know what I'm saying? You want to live as long as you can, free. You want to? Ain't nobody. That's, man. The, that's the goal. Man, who wants to be locked up? What? Nothing but boys, twenty four seven. <laughs> one on top, you one at the uh, bottom, one on the side, one on the uh, other side, and all that. Woo, woo, woo. Yes, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, there ain't nobody now. You know what I'm saying? You smelling like you smelling stale. You don't even know you stale. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You think just because you got some sure, sure deodorant, nigga, you in there he stale. Said, he said AC out. Hey, you know what I'm saying? AC out. You know what I'm saying? You niggas don't know, man. You on the motherfucker going lockdown, nigga. You on your bunk, nigga. You getting ja- Johnny's. Johnny's. You know what I'm Johnny's. saying? Straight Johnny's. You know what I'm saying? 
God damn, you gotta go to the shoe. You gotta go shit. Nigga, you gotta shit, nigga. You gotta take all your drawers off. You don't know if a nigga finna slide you. Nigga, I ain't never take a shit, nigga, with my drawers on, nigga. All my drawers coming off, nigga. Everything come off, nigga. Whoa. I'm on, nigga, I'm on the shit of naked, nigga. I wish a nigga would. Nigga, you better learn your way in that bitch. I wish a nigga uh, would. But we ain't gonna get to that penitentiary talk. We ain't gonna get to that penitentiary hey, talk. Yeah, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we ain't gonna go there. You know Man. what I'm saying? Nigga, I had many Sweet. many fights. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, I nigga G4. Nigga, I done got G4. You know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, I had to go. Man. You know what I'm saying? Like, I had to go. So, like, I know. Bro, I'm, uh, man, nigga, just, uh, every, uh, every day is a blessing, man, to, uh, still be able to create some, uh, some good music, man. That's the goal. And, right. And do it at a high level. Right. And, man. I'm still here. I'm still doing it. Yeah, yeah, shit, I nah, man. And like, I hate, I hate our genre of music is the only genre of oh man, some old you old niggas need to go sit down somewhere. Rock and roll. Need to go. Rock yeah, and roll, like R and B, R and B. Don't say I motherfucking get, I, fuck. Hey, don't fuck. Hey, fuck that's don't. What I'm I guarantee you that. Uh, a, a a rock band that's playing on Sixth Street in Austin right now is not gonna turn down a uh, a damn song with Brett Michaels and Poison and them, uh Motley Crue right now. Right, but see, cause he, he, he nothing, cause we, we we a lot of us ain't feeding them. You know, you know why? I, a lot of us, a lot of us just join them. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Because oh, because, this, uh, because, because we relate. And that, I mean, and yeah. I understand we relate, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. And like, yeah, okay, we, instead of us really just being, like I was saying earlier, men, you know what I'm saying? Because when, when I was growing up, we had men, like, say, like, what you doing? Like, go on, youngster, you know what I'm saying? Get from around here. And then you had <laughs> the other nigga who was just, nigga, Coke 45, <laughs> bl Slits Blue Bull, you know what I'm saying? Mouth liquor, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Like Saint Ide, Saint Ide, Saint Ide, nigga, nigga, about, nigga, here, youngster. You know what I'm saying, nigga? Nigga, fuck that bitch, youngster. <laughs> Say, nigga, uh, smell my finger, youngster. Yeah, 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 I feel <laughs> you know what I'm just wow. Wow, you know what yeah. I'm saying? And, and, and it's like, shit, you know, but, but but in the back of your head, you know, we we got that, you know, thank, like, people like you, us, like us, you know, like, they don't know that it's a blessing to get here, you know what I'm saying? Because a lot of, uh, like, I know a lot of people I knew at, at an early age died. Oh, yeah, for sure. You know what I'm That's saying? Too R.I.P. Still, my nigga Capo. Yeah, sure. R.I.P. And still, still dying, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, it's like, we blessed to even be here. Stuff and stuff, we don't, niggas, I was just telling them the other day, but... It's like slow your road, you know what I'm saying? Cause all of them dying, like everybody dying and getting locked up right now. And your hardest artist be out for a couple, a year or two, and then he get locked up or he get killed. Nigga, how the jail is almost at capacity, Man, nigga. They don't care. They got a flow. You know that. You get a flow. You can get the flow with the mat or without the mat. <laughs> and summertime, you better have a cup of water and put it on there because it's gonna be hot. You know what Same, I'm saying? Bro. I don't remember when they had people. When, I remember one time in Lusteric, they had us all stacked up on top of each other. I remember back in Lusteric when the when they had the bull ring and everybody used to be packed up in there before you even even before you even go to uh, uh what's that pre trial release and shit. Man, <laughs> yeah, bro. Uh, how to, uh so man is uh nah, they just be uh trying to stay out these folks' way, nigga. Just uh stay out doing, way. Uh, doing music. Uh, we got we got to change the narrative. That's all it is. It's like it's like if we gonna want something out of, we got to change the narrative. You know what I'm saying? It ain't hard to change the narrative. Think about it. Our greatest rapper. You said Ice Cube. The I mean, I, I'm not the, not the greatest rapper. I'm saying one of the rappers that influenced you at that time that you were listening to. Like man, it's you know? a well, oh man. But even though it's a lot more, but I'm yeah. just using that as one because I because I'm gonna ask you that question. But what I'm saying is this: it's like he was balanced. Oh, he, he was a, he was able to teach you this, give you that, you know what I'm saying? That and Political, then come to the part. Yeah, 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 it was a balance. Yeah. yeah. That's what I man, I loved PE, man. I loved uh Chuck D. That's See? probably one of the man uh man PE. What's I your top to five? What's that? your top five? But my right. top five top greatest album all, all, all time. Uh, artists. Artists? All time. You talking about to all, not even rappers? Man, you can do rappers. You know what I'm saying? Then we gonna do R and B separate or whatever you want, whatever. Shit. Yeah, yeah. Nah, yeah. shit, my head. We gonna put it to you there. 
You know what I'm saying? Work, bench press. You know what I'm saying? It's game time. Well, you know? uh, oh, okay, on rap. This because I know a... you ain't gonna give me no freestyle. Oh no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, but uh, the fucking um, damn. On the rap, we gonna go Tupac one, Ooh. Biggie two. What? Whoa, 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 whoa! I don't. Nah, I ain't gonna talk about this. Fuck I ain't gonna talk about that. Damn. I'm gonna put I'm gonna put face at three. Okay, face. Damn right. Hey, face get well. He in the hospital, man. Shout out face, man. Face mom. Yeah, man. Uh, Jay Z at four. <laughs> Damn, that five is. <laughs> <laughs> My nigga Nas, nigga. Ooh, Ethan. That boy put that boy Ethan in there. Yeah. Ooh, Chihuahua. Man, Nas, Ooh, is, Nas, is the, man, Nas is it, man. Okay, all right. I can give you that. And that's the rap. But, but that, I listen to so many people's music. Lord, I listen to so many people's I think so they were coming music. back out with the Firm album or something like that. I ain't they seen it, man. Nas, 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 you talking about online? They going to yeah, do they it again? They, they supposed to been coming back together or something. I know that. I know I know. AZ. Oh, oh yeah. You uh, know what AZ. Yeah, yeah. Man, man, AZ, man. AZ hard, too. For sure. Foxy back <laughs> in the booth. Oh, hey, oh, for real? Yeah, Foxy back in there, too. Damn. You know what I'm saying? Like, shit, it's going. Man, it's oh, it's live again. It's, man, it's a, man, they say. They, they, them young niggas ain't do nothing but give, give, give us a, 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 get, get them more light. Now they like, I'm finna show you how to do it. And yeah. they showing them how to do it. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. You know, and, and it's just yeah, what it is. But I think it, it's a life. Because, man, it's a, it's a misconception, man, on the cool. Like, what? if you get older, some some of your skills might decline if, you know what I'm saying, in some way. But sometimes some skills might incline. Yeah, but, but that's what I'm saying. But that's when that's when you find your mojo. It always it's like a, it's always you gotta always train yourself. You can't never. That's why I say you can't never stop learning. You gotta yeah, for always sure. train yourself. You yeah. know what I'm saying. Yeah. And you gotta always be ready. You know what I'm saying. You never because you never know. You know what I'm saying. Like it's plenty of times when I learned. I was like at one time when I was rapping. I was like, damn, I'm country than a motherfucker. I say, <laughs> I say, I say so, yeah, they. Cause, and and yeah, I, I had to teach myself. Accents, yeah. I, no, I sounded so much like Pimp C. <laughs> so, nah, facts. That's another reason why I kind of stopped rapping mm. because I I sounded so much like Pimp C. Not, I'm not trying. It's just how I talk. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And it was just like, and I also had my own voice, but it was just like how everything was coming out. And I was like, I had to train myself how to really just embody a whole st another style to, to man, fit my language. You hey, know what man, I'm saying? Uh, te uh, Texas people, man, we we got our own whole language and culture, boy. Yeah. So they, you know what I'm saying? But <laughs> that shit was funny. One time we was, we did a show in uh, North Carolina with Mike Jones and uh, the, <laughs> the, uh, Mike Jones. <laughs> say, say. The 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 uh the DJ uh if me and Gators on the bike and uh, we go there saying like yeah what's up uh Green from North Carolina what's going down the uh DJ y'all ready for Mike Jones and, yeah you ready for Mike Jones yeah but first the ball players from Dallas Texas is putting the rhythm nigga they booed the shit out of us nigga. <laughs> What? What? <laughs> that's the only. That's the only time I ever got booed in my whole career. I swear. <laughs> yeah. Right before you said that, I was about to say they tried it today. They're gonna get booed. <laughs> Man, that must now, now, now. What that was, see, kid. See, that, that's what you call a janky promoter. <laughs> uh, nah, bro. Say, but now, even after we did the show, uh -huh. uh, we came through the crowd and people. Told us they was like, nah, y'all jammed food. Uh, nah, nah, yeah, that, so I mean, they was like, y'all jammed. You know, yeah, but they, but, they who Mike Jones was and everything, for yeah, sure. Yeah, but goddamn, that's crazy. Did Mike Jones come? 
Yeah, he was there. Oh, he was he there. He went on after us, yeah. Oh, okay. He went on. Oh, okay. That's all that matters. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, if he was there, then wasn't no Jacob Promote. I so I'm just up bringing it up because they yeah. think that it's going to a different thought, part of yeah, the they country. Thought, yeah. yeah, they thinking this, you know what I'm saying? They right. hear the accents or whatever, you know. And, talking about, and the ball players come out in this motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? They were like, <laughs> they, damn. I'm like, they're like, boo. They, <laughs> <laughs> hey, what that nigga say? That sure don't look like Mike uh, Mike Jones to me. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, talking about, nigga and shit, that ain't my baby. That baby white. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> talking so. about that baby from the caucuses from out <laughs> <laughs> That was the only time I ever got booed at the show. <laughs> That's crazy, man. What other stories you got like that, man? That's some crazy ass. <laughs> oh, man. Damn, this. <laughs> I know you got a wild one. Give, give me one of them wild ones. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Give me one you like to share. Man, it's been man, it's way, man, man, it's too many of them. Oh God. Lord Jesus. Not Jesus. You talking about little you talking about Jesus or little sweet baby Jesus? Man. <laughs> 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 man, that, that, oh, you talking boy. about black Jesus. What I, cause, you know, now you know on the internet they got so many Jesus. <laughs> you know what I'm black, saying? He said black little baby black Jesus. <laughs> Uh, you say uh, ODB, uh, big baby Jesus. You know what I'm saying? I'm so, you know what I'm saying? Bubble Jesus. You know, I had the bubble gum shrimp. You know what I'm saying? Shrimp fry shrimp, barbecue uh, shrimp, uh, <laughs> rubber shrimp Jesus. Like, <laughs> I walk on water Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm for real, Lord. Jesus, I'm a Lord. I said, Lord. <laughs> Look what it's like. <laughs> Lord. Uh, nah, man. Uh, God damn. That's a uh, man. Say, that's funny. I like that. <laughs> I don't fuck the nigga whole train of thought up. Nigga like the nigga whole thoughts just say, God damn. <laughs> nigga got me up here laughing and shit. Oh, uh, that's what up, man. That's how it's supposed to be, man. You yeah. know, I like it to say, man. That's how I treat my guests. Like, man, like, it's like, man, it's like going back in the time capsule. You know what I'm saying? Like, back on the block. You know what I'm saying? How a nigga used to be. You know what I'm saying? Man. Living life. You know what I'm saying? I think that's what a lot of us forgot. We're living life, man, because we always on the go now. Like, I got to go work. I got to pay the bills. I got to da 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 And yeah. then it just got us like a, a damn machine. Even on you. Boy. They, they got a machine just da 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 You know? Yeah. Yeah, man. I remember back in the day, you just pull up to the park. You like, nigga, it's like we been there all week or something. Like, damn, nigga, we been, nigga, when you going home, nigga? Nigga, you gonna take a shower, nigga? Uh, <laughs> nigga, little homie had the same shit he had on yesterday. Man, say. But uh, yeah, I said, but I bet that nigga had a pocket full of money. Boy. Just like how you said shit, nigga, hell, nigga, yeah, 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 nigga, but nigga, do the Dougie and slide you. Yeah, uh. Hey man, Dallas is a man. Dallas is a great place, but man, watch what you doing. Watch it. Watch what you do. What anything you do, watch my shoes. Now, yeah, and do what you do. Nigga. Watch my shoes. Nigga. Watch what you doing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that used to be fucked up, nigga. We used to have to tell nigga, wash your shoes. Nigga, niggas really getting fight that. Starter jackets. Nigga, you <laughs> boy, nigga, nigga will ray fill you. Nigga will ray fill you for a goddamn starter jacket. Nigga, what? them J's. Oh, goddamn, nigga, you better not have no J's on, nigga. Oh, That's nigga. That's oh, a, shit. Damn. God. Boy, say. I, I didn't need to go look at that footage from the parade again. They, boy, they, they, they were down there, but a nigga smash it. We talking about what, the Dallas uh, oh, Cowboys? Oh, man. They man, man but a nigga down there smash it. Man, Dallas, I'm talking about, they was in the, and you couldn't see. All you all you seen were ants. Then, you know what I'm saying? You know how ants come when you hit the ant pal and motherfuckers just come out. You yeah. know what I'm saying? That's all you see. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, damn. Man, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I was like, shit. I was like, whoa, we. And it was a lot of, it was like, it was a lot of, and a lot of essays out there too. And then, you know what I'm saying? You, I seen a lot of pink people too. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, for real, for real. We <laughs> <laughs> say, damn, that's why we say we can't have nothing, man. This man, this man. They, they took everything, man. They took Union Arena away. Yeah. They took the star, uh, uh, the uh, what was that, uh, the stadium, uh, 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 oh, uh, uh, oh, yeah, the sportatorium, yeah, yeah. Man, just think about it. They took the football, the Cowboy Stadium, oh, the Irvin Stadium. They took that it's, away. Yeah, Texas Stadium. Hey, man, it's like all of man. I don't even man. It's a lot of stuff. Like, they even took away all most of all of our car washes. <sighs> you done took away my, my my car wash, dude. Dude, I'll be on over. Why? Why you shut down my Overton car wash? Matter of fact, why you shut down the MLK car wash? Man, say, uh, 
they say, man. This is history. But I, I don't know, bro. I think, you know, uh, man. I know we need a change. I know. The the South, man, the South was cool to go, but. Come on, Pastor Kool-Aid. Talk to me. Bishop Lawton, listen. <laughs> Bishop Lawton, listen. Bishop Lawton over here listening to Pastor, you know what I'm uh, saying? Pastor Kool-Aid. Tell me what he talked to nah, me, bro. bro. Well, <laughs> man, it used to be, man, it used to be cool to uh go out there and cruise and stuff and you know what I'm saying? Just roll and try to holler at women, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. All that. Mm -hmm. but, See the cars, new cars, man, and the little niggas got up in that shit, you know say. what I'm saying? Hey man, say man, going around, hey, man, make a couple of dollars, you never know, you know what I'm saying? All that. But, but <laughs> that's a data study. You said, but Lord, <laughs> but <laughs> nah, I say. Uh, man, I used to, I used to like Rochester though. Rochester, Rochester Park. was fun. Like, man, that, that was fun. It's still, and it's still, it's still, it's still, it's still be doing its thing. I ain't been out there in a minute. Man. It still kind of do its thing, but it ain't like it was like it was back in the day. I remember, my, my nigga, you couldn't get once you went there, you ain't getting out to everybody leave. <laughs> <laughs> Am I lying? Say we go, we go up to that uh, motherfucker about twelve p.m. Man, niggas, you, when niggas uh, wanted to go, uh, nigga, you seen niggas going over the grass through the hill and bitch trying to get up out that. You remember? You yeah. up there, they be like, Dang, they yo. gotta they gotta stay till dark. <laughs> but shit, sure. Man, shout out, man. So, man, I always ask this question. Okay. And if you was in my shoes, what question would you ask yourself that I didn't ask? Hmm. I don't know. I, like, uh, I man, say this has been a great interview to me. I done enjoyed myself. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Um, hmm. Damn. Uh, <laughs> what? Uh, probably. Where, where, uh, you where you could reach me at on all my socials. You know what I'm saying? At Mister Kool Aid One Hundred. <laughs> all and everything, Mister Kool Aid One Hundred. Goddamn me, shit. Goddamn me, marketing one. <laughs> Oh, one. You know if you need saying? a beat or a verse or yeah. whatever you vote, I yeah. got it for you. Yeah. Man, there you yeah. go. There you go, right there. Shit, what you think about that new track with uh, Yellow Bees and, and uh, Lil Wayne? Man. Yeah, have you checked it out or have you heard it? Man, I ain't heard oh, it, bro. Man, it's wrong. You got Lil Wayne on the album. Yeah, it's I need wrong. to check it out, fam. Yeah. My, Look, man. Um, and High Boys on the tour. Oh, I did see that. They that, gonna uh, that, 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 get yeah. back together at the Louisiana mm -hmm. Fest. Mm -hmm. I see what's that. name on tour? Fiend and um, Mac. Yeah, that's what's up too. Ooh, yeah. Uh, they doing live band and old songs. I'm like, Whoosh. man, yeah. Boy, I, say, I hit Fiend up. I got right in the inbox. I said, hey, hey, hey hit me up when you come to Dallas. All right, I got you. That's got what's you. up, man. <laughs> For real, because... I already man, told him. Hey, man, we was... <laughs> <laughs> I, I already told him. <laughs> Mr. Womp Womp. You did. You know what I'm saying? For yeah. real. Who got that fire? Yeah, man, so man, we got to do every smoke song on the podcast. And then smoke song. Man. Diamond D had a badass smoke song, too, back in the day. <laughs> on man. that Domino. Oh, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, man. We, uh, it, man, I miss them days when nigga had the whole album. Yeah, of the oh yeah, you say a song of this, a song of that, a song of and this. And then I always had the smoke, that. and then the smoke anthem. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Then the cipher, then the cipher. <laughs> it was a of, yeah, you say man, kind of a uh, you know method. That, uh, and then yeah, cause, uh, you know an uh, uh, effort to cover some stuff. I used to like going through the books. I used to like the posters. I used to get. I oh, missed yeah. that. I'm, I'm, I missed that. And a lot of, but they, you know they bringing it back too though. They bringing it back. And the old school game coming back now, you know, they doing their hand over fish, you know what I'm saying? They bringing the, um, like, the artists are now buying directly from the artists. They ain't trying to, yeah. you know, really support yeah. most of the um, platforms, you know what yeah. I'm saying? No shade on the platform, but they just, people, yeah. the Direct artists, to consumer the artists are understanding and the fans are starting to understand what's going on. So now you're shooting that, man, it's going back to people making their own website, Putting everything on there, boo 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 boo. Yeah, yeah. Just like how back in the day we would have MySpace with the PayPal link. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Say, man, it's uh, man, they letting all them record labels consolidating and doing right. all the types of stuff. And, right. You know, mm -hmm. they, they, yeah, they do. They got something going on. Man, uh, what podcast you be watching? Man, 
I look at the Joe Button. <laughs> Joe Button. All right. Yeah. Joe Button. No, he go hard. He go hard. Uh, I look at million dollars worth of game. Million dollars worth of game. Yeah. Uh, Gilly. Yeah. Uh, and Wallow and shit. And yeah, uh, Gilly and Wallow. Man, I look at a lot, a lot of people like yeah. Big Facts. Um, Big Facts. Yeah. Man, who? Was, man, man. Who you looking at? A whole shit. A whole bunch of stuff, bro. Uh, Cause I don't. I don't even look at regular TV really no more. It's just straight YouTube, YouTube fam. YouTube is the TV. Yeah. It's the TV today. That's all it is. Yeah. Everybody like this now. <laughs> so yeah, you know, when I ain't working on music, I look at uh, some f- stuff, you know what I'm saying, mm. on the fire stick, look at a movie or some shit, or uh, 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 the latest fight or something. Right, right, right. Uh, the play playoffs in some sports. Right. Who your, who your top five favorite producer? Gotcha. Cause I ain't getting no rapping out of you. I, I would, I would make, I would make him make a beat on the spot. You know what I'm saying? I would make him make a beat so, on the spot. It would, so it would probably just, uh, you. It would probably take me about to, if you just you know, show me what to do, you uh-huh. know, the, where the sounds at, nigga. Yeah, I mean, I do it, man. What? <laughs> huh? I do need to make a series where the boys come through this boy and yeah. get on, get on, get on the, get yeah. on the NPC yeah, and make and make them beat. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Because all I gotta do is plug in right there. But man, hey, I've been, I've been, man, yeah, nah, I've man. already been. Uh, Man, I've been looking at Rhythm Roulette for the past few days too. Man, they ain't been putting out no new stuff. They haven't. They, it's over with. You know what I'm saying? But but you know what? But that's nice stuff. Yeah. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? But I I, I like what he did. You know, oh, I, man. I think the best, it, it's a, it's, I think it's like three or four, but Big Crit had, Big Crit Hell had. Hell yeah. Big Crit had, dude, oof. David Banner. <laughs> David Banner. That's the show we was watching where they would make the beat in the end. Yeah. Big Crit and David Banner. Yeah. And, and, yeah. and Ninth Wonder. Ninth Wonder. Of course, Ninth, ninth and, Wonder. And, and uh, the Nine Porter from D12. Oh yeah, uh huh, yeah. He did his thing. It was somebody else on there. I'm trying to think of. You know what I'm saying? Somebody else came on there and cooked some up. What was? It? Oh, I, they gonna they gonna they gonna kick me in my ass. <laughs> what God, you talking about, man? Goddamn me, <laughs> motherfucking me. Uh, Noah's. Uh, uh, um, not now. Um, from Atlanta. Um. Oh, organized, organized noise. noise. Yeah, yeah. yeah. goddamn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Organized man, noise. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Y'all trying to act like y'all yeah, don't know nah, what I'm nah, talking nah, about. Nah, 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 I did now. I did Pass the Kool Aid. Pass the Kool Aid. Pass the Kool Aid. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, organized noise. It's not like it's saying pass man. the Kool Aid, but I'm saying pass the Kool Aid. <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Man. Bishop Lawton trying to get yeah. an understanding over here while we're over here. A River Leon Lonnie Love. That's a bad. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, organized. No, I mean, they came in there and that mo- boy say that right there. That, I think that was one of the most like thought out, the most um, well put together project or beat they did for that show, man. Because how they took all them samples, they didn't Hell curl. Yeah, they, they didn't. They man, they didn't curl what they got. They got each one man, of them what? and took each piece out of. Uh, Every last one of them. But the thing was about it, though. This the thing about it, though. I'm telling you, Kenfo, listen to this. This the thing about it. They took all them samples from each one of those albums. Yeah. And each one of them took a piece from that and, yeah, and, and they did they it put themselves. Yeah, it all together. Yeah, yeah, for sure. And put it together. Yeah, put it together. Well, I was I'm like, like, and that shit, all of it matched. I was like, damn, that shit didn't even sound like it was going to match. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. But Big Crit Same. though, Big Same. Crit, I think Big Crit do get the, you man. know what I'm saying? I think Big Crit get the goddamn play. Man, for the, man it, yeah, it's him. Yeah. And guess what? Guess what he was using, nigga? Ableton. Reason, nigga. No, that was Ableton. Fir- no. Nah, that was Ableton. Go, nah, nah, when he start Ableton. doing them drums, nah, 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 man, that nah. nigga start using Reason, nah, man. Man, <laughs> man, no, 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 no. My boy was using it. Nah, he didn't, right he didn't, he didn't, he didn't have a push. But he had he had a mini keyboard <laughs> using Ableton. Bro, I think bro. I mean, oh, no, I see no, I seen the Ableton nah. screen on there. You did, yeah. yeah. What? So you but seen it? But hold up, so you seen yeah, it? Yeah, I seen it. Mm-hmm. I'm telling you, but yeah. Mm-hmm. But, you seen it? All right, yeah. okay. All right. I'm gonna go back and look just because you said it, bro. Because you know I'm gonna believe you. I ain't know that, I when that nigga start putting them drums up in there. I he said, oh, reason. my nigga got the reason cracking. <clears throat> you can hear, you know, I can tell. Wow. 
By the metronome. By the metronome. That, yeah, okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? All right, that's cool. All right. Yeah, all right. Well, shout out to Reason and shout out to Ableton. You know what I'm saying? God damn, sure. it's going down. You know what I'm saying? That's but right. all them, but say, boy, that's I say, right. but that's the, I like, that's the art of music right there. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's the whole, that's the whole point of music is really taking all this stuff. Taking this gumbo pot and then just seeing what you can do, what you can do, yeah. what you can do. You know what I'm saying? And and then y'all come through there, like you say, y'all be in that corner. And then yeah. the next thing you know, you come out. Ding, 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 da, 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 da. You know what I'm saying? You remember them games you used to have with the little with the boxer right there? And the first thing you hit the nigga, as soon as you get that nigga, ding, ding, ding. Yeah, 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 yeah. You see which one? They say rock em, rock em, sock em. Rock em, sock em, da, 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 da. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Rock them, sock them, root by the But man, I just want to say, man, I appreciate you. You know what I'm saying? Not only for coming through, but I also appreciate you for painting the wall, writing your name, you know what I'm saying? Shaping, contributing, molding the culture of Dallas, you know what I'm saying? With the sound carrying that, see, that's what we don't do here. And this is what this platform is for, you know what I'm saying? No, I appreciate it for and, real. And, you know, like, you got to come back for round two. You know oh, yeah, 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 yeah. We yeah. definitely got to do that. Yeah, this was fun. And right now, you know, uh, the floor is yours. I, any shout outs and all that, you know, do, do what you do. Oh, man, just a uh, shout out to all my family and people that food with me. You know, I blame it on my mind and not my heart. I love everybody. Mm. Go just check out my music on all the platforms. You know what I'm saying? That's it. Visuals coming soon. More projects coming soon. It's going down. And that, that nigga just modest, boy. That, that, say, let me tell you this one. Check this out. <laughs> I get on. Go with, <laughs> hit the link. <laughs> so Everything cool. Get all that. Get all that. Everything cool. Get all Everything cool. Get all that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Shout out, shout out everybody. You know what I'm saying? Shout out everybody. You know what I'm saying? Goddamn me. Hey, hey. Whole Triple D, Oak Cliff, everybody, you already know what it is. You God already damn, know. You already know what it is. Much love, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to all the podcasts, you know what I'm saying? Now that, you know, I know what podcasts he be watching, now he gonna be watching Lit Podcast. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe, you know what I'm saying? Hit that bell, ding, 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 ding. You know what I'm saying? Get that motherfucking notification. Oh, I'm already subscribed. Here, you know what I'm saying? Motherfucking bitch! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Lock up to my feet, hurt to slay, yeah. yeah. Better yeah. off worse to the good with the bad, yeah. yeah. I took a ride in the L.L. Corner, yeah. I'm talking cold, 